What's up, Dan Gang? It's your boy Dame Dash, and I'm back with another video for y'all. Hey, y'all, did you miss me? I hope so. I miss you guys so much today, y'all. I'm taking it easy. I have Cheesecake Factory here. I just ordered this from DoorDash. I have their meatloaf with mashed potatoes and gravy, and I ordered some Brussels sprouts. And I ordered some Brussels sprouts, y'all. I keep getting them open. Okay. I'm starving. I don't. This is what it is. What it is. I hope y'all. <laughs> I hope y'all can see it. Good. Let me see if I can. Okay. <laughs> what did? Look. Look. Is one of those don't worry about it videos, okay? I'm hungry. Hopefully, it don't mess up my mouth. Let's see if y'all can get a good little one, two, a little good view. Let's do a thumbnail. I hope that look good. Okay, so I got their famous meatloaf, mashed potatoes, and corn. Mm-hmm. It's soft. What is this? It's a big ass. Oh, they're wrong. Look at this. Oh, at least you know they potatoes is homemade. Look at that big ass potato. Oh yeah, that is a whole ass potato. Okay. Alright. So if y'all watched my last video, which was yesterday, I had um Popeyes. I really wasn't eating it like that. Because I just got um my teeth. I have um Smile Direct Club. They're like mm -mm. You know, the retainers, braces, the clear ones. So my, te my teeth are shifting. They're very, very loose and, and sensitive. And my first time trying to eat, I was trying to eat some damn fried chicken oil. Chicken breast. Nobody told me that I shouldn't do that. Mm. So, I'm on the soft foods. This is like one of the best meatloafs I ever had. And mashed potatoes really good. They are homemade, as we just found out. Together, I think my mashed potato was chunky, but dang, that was a whole chunk. And I got some Brussels sprouts. Mm-hmm. Mm. With some crispy pieces in our my bacon. Got a little too crispy. Mm. Uh, I got my aligner share. Smile the Red Club. In my last video, I did wrap them in the napkins and I put them in my drawer. I don't have anything in there. I know a lot of people say, uh uh, don't do that. That's the number one thing you don't want to do is wrap them in paper towel because you'll end up throwing them away. I know, I know that that was a bad thing. But damn, I, um, 
they're my case now. This is how they look, real. I literally just took them off, y'all, so it might be a little slob in them. Don't son of boy hurt, okay? Ooh, that hurt. But it's it's not like an unbearable pain. You get what I mean? It's it's just a hurt from not ever having braces or having anything foreign in your mouth. It's just like a, a foreign thing in your mouth, moving stuff and doing stuff that you shouldn't be doing. Or you're not used to it doing. It's not unbearable. I just need to tell you some type of um, pain pill. Like I took a pain because I knew I was about to eat. I took some Excedrin. I had put like some orange gel and this other stuff I had bought. And I gargled with the medicine all in my mouth, so it won't be as, as sensitive. I was like, I've got to do a video. I got to get a video done. Mm. Bro, I never like Brussels sprouts. Never. Until I had them char bowl or char however they make them with the sauce just having them boiled they nasty like regular boil mm -mm. I don't like it oh my god I need to call them I need another, I need some money back or something. This junk was high. And for all these potatoes to be chunky like them. That's crazy. But, on your meatloaf, you like meatloaf? Do you like it with gravy? Do you like it with tomato sauce? Do you like it with barbecue sauce? How you like it? Me, I let my meat low with barbecue sauce. Mm -hmm. Like if I'm making it myself, that's what I use barbecue sauce. Hmm. Yesterday's video was pre recorded. Hmm. The actual day of Sunday, I took it really, really easy. I didn't really. Well, I tried to take it easy, but I didn't eat anything for real. I went to Anthony House. He had a gathering. I had made two pans of lasagna. I made a seafood lasagna. And I made a um a regular lasagna. He had like family game night. He asked for me to cook. So I did that. And I was editing my video, my vlog, right? I was editing my vlog. I don't know what happened. My my Final Cut Pro app is just blinked off. All right, literally just cut off. In the middle of me editing, I'm like, what the hell? So I click back on it. Nothing is on there. Like none of the video, none of the footage, nothing. Mind you, it's late, and um, I had like three hours worth of footage that I was gonna break down into an hour to give y'all a long vlog because y'all been saying how y'all like the long vlogs. Y'all want me to go to the short ones. So having three hours worth of footage take like an hour sometimes to um, transfer it over. 
And it was just all gone, y'all. I was so mad yesterday. So mad because after cooking all that time, I think I went up there around like one. I didn't get done cooking till like six. And then when I got done, I still gotta work. I gotta get this video edited. But I was like, the good thing about it is I already transferred all of my information, all of my files over to my laptop. So now all I gotta do is edit it. And it should be good. I'm gonna have it out around 9 30, 10. It'd be a little late, but it'll be there, you know? Man, that junk crashed and it made me so mad. Like, so mad. Cause I don't like missing days. I don't like I don't like that. I don't like that, especially because I know how y'all are. Y'all be ready. The people who watch my vlog channel, they be ready, waiting on my posting days for a vlog. Just like y'all, when I post them up, and y'all be ready. So. That instantly yeah, made me mad. And then today, I don't know what, oh, you know why? Okay, it had instantly made me mad. I wasn't even drinking like that because I was like, I still got to work. <laughs> I was pissed. I said, bump it. I started drinking. Next thing you know, I'm a little lit. I was supposed to be transferring my files back over to the laptop again. I ain't up doing none of that. <laughs> Didn't do nothing. Mouth back, soul back hurting. I left out in the house for the first time today, like at 2.40. Ran to the grocery store to get some food. Because it's supposed to be like a snowstorm on Wednesday. It's supposed to start on Wednesday at 4 a.m. So Tuesday night, basically. Tuesday morning. Tuesday night, Wednesday morning. 4 a.m. It's supposed to get 12 inches of snow here. So I was like, well, let me go to the grocery store and get a few things now before it's all, like, ran over. I got a whole bunch of cereal, a whole bunch of milk. We got just dinner for tomorrow. I'm going to go to the grocery store again tomorrow. Because when we get snow like that, it's going to be crazy here. And then everything, like the DoorDash, Instacart, all those, the sur what do they call it, the surplus? The influx in the price and stuff, everything gonna be skyrocket. Like so high. And that's how we getting twelve to fourteen inches of snow. Mm -mm. So Once I got home, I took out my stuff for my my um my team. And I still gotta edit my vlog. I'm a, I'm gonna edit it. I don't care how late it is. When I get done with them, but bang, I'm just I'm not editing this. I'm just sending it right out, and then um, I'm gonna edit my vlog and get that out to y'all. Mm. I think the pain pills got me looping. But this food is so good and I can really enjoy it. My mouth not acting weird right now. My front two teeth though. Ooh. Them bad boys, they hurt. And I can feel that they loose. Like, I can feel it. Mm, I can feel it. 
And this is my first tray, my first week. I'm gonna put them on Saturday morning. What about 4 a.m.? So, mmm, let me tell you another thing. In my sleep, y'all. I put my I put my if it's a line in my mouth. But in my sleep they be bothering me honestly. Something in me just take up out my mouth when I'm sleep. I don't understand. I wake up sometimes and the damn teeth they mean that the things be on the night on the side of me. And I never remember taking them out my mouth. Mmm. I gotta give. And they ain't gonna work. That's when they're supposed to be in there the most. Oh, y'all wanna know something funny? <laughs> in my last video with the Popeyes, why well, was Invisalign in the comment section? <laughs> that was in the comment section and like Talking to people who was talking about like the pain of the teeth and how it hurt and stuff like that. I'm like, that's crazy because this video, my video wasn't sponsored by them. I don't even use Invisalign. I'm using Smile Direct Club. But Invisalign was in the comments of my videos talking to the people. Like, just saying, oh, I'm sorry about that. It shouldn't hurt if it hurt. You know, basically doing like, like, um, what's that? PR or damage control or something like that. That was so funny to me. If y'all really want to do damage control or PR sponsor me, and I can talk about it and do the whole little thing and tell them what it is and what it's supposed to be, okay? We can fix that. I see y'all in the comments and visit online. I'm going to slide in my uh, email. One page is, um, this bill for these, you know. What's up? Hmm. We can talk it out, babe. Oh, man. I'm full. There's no way for me to finish this. They give you three nice pieces of Milo. Corn. Supposed to be some. Their mashed potatoes are good. They just damn blend all of mine, okay? Mm hmm. These big ass potatoes. Okay. Mm -hmm. I gotta eat more. I did my first time eating this seven times. But let me tell you, I don't eat or drink anything to make me want to have to take these things out of my mouth. If you want to lose some weight, You want to go on some type of diet? Get you some Invisalign or some Smile Direct Cup um, retainers for your teeth. Fix your teeth and lose your weight at the same time. I'm trying to, you ain't going to want to take these mugs out your mouth. I just be drinking water because I can drink water with them. Can't have no gum, can't chew nothing. I'll put a mint on my tongue. You want to lose some weight? And fix your teeth? That's the way you do it. 
Two for one, baby. <clears throat> you ain't gonna eat nothing. Nothing. Okay, y'all. Look. <clears throat> I think it's because I've just been relaxing. Just taking it easy. Mm. Trying to get adjusted to this. I'm just tired. Right? My energy draining, you know? Mm -hmm. I'm fixing my teeth now so once I get my veneers, I don't have to. Because I've been seeing a lot of people who get veneers and stuff, and I just be like, they just put bigger teeth. If you got a gap, they don't close your gap. They just put bigger teeth on your teeth to make your gap close. Like, the way they do things to fix your imperfections in your, you know, with your new teeth is just cover them with bigger teeth or... Lay, I don't, I don't know. If I if I get my teeth done, I want it to look beautiful. I want a flawless smile. I don't want to have the same problems that I have with my current teeth, with keep my teeth with my new teeth. So I'm fixing my smile now, closing up the gaps, putting my teeth because it's not like I have an overbite. All of my teeth don't go over my bottom teeth, just my top front two, and they go over my bottom. And it, that's the only thing that's wrong. So when I have the retainers on, in my mouth, it sits different. And like it sits how it's supposed to sit. Like it's like this. You see? It's like this. But regular, it's like this. You you can't tell the difference, I don't think, but it's just these two just stick out way more. So it doesn't make it even. And it do change your facial structure. So, I don't know. I've been wanting to get my teeth done. I don't know if it's because I started doing YouTube. <clears throat> but everything now, me looking at myself every day in front of the camera and stuff like that, it just makes me want to fix all my little things I've been wanting to fix. But it just makes me want to fix it even more, especially vlogging. Especially vlogging, like my beard, facial hair, always been like an issue for me. But now I'm like, oh, now I gotta fix this like sooner. That's why I cut it down. I'm trying to fix the um the problem areas that I have. I need to make me an appointment with the dermatologist, but they can look at my skin and see, you know, what's going on. If they recommend me to do anything or stop doing something, I'm just trying to get everything that I want. Taken care of. I was trying to see if Lifetime was gonna have some type of discount because I really want to go to Lifetime Gym. They got so many things. They high like a hundred dollars a month, a hundred and fifty if you want to be able to bring a guest. Like they're very very high monthly. So I thought they was gonna come down if I went and signed the little the little deal. It ain't a contract. It's month to month. The contract it, like is nothing that's you know cheaper. I'm trying to see if it's a coupon or something. Cause a hundred dollars a month, like I should just instantly lose weight for that. You know what I'm saying? Like what? But they got a pool, sauna, jacuzzi, indoor and outdoor pool. Like in the summertime, it's like a a whole amusement park, water slide. You can have parties there. Yoga, they got everything you could think of in the gym. I, I must, I think you can get massages there. It's just lit. They had a hair salon in there, and they got a little restaurant in there. <clears throat> got a lot of stuff. I just thought they was gonna be like running a special. They ain't running shit. So, I might as well go ahead and buckle down and, spend, and pay. Because so that, that's what I really want, so. I'm just going to pay for it. Okay, I've been talking, talking, talking much ago. I'm not even hungry anymore. I'm full. Okay, so there's a few things I want you to comment down below. Comment down below if you've ever had Cheesecake Factory Meatloaf. If you did, let me know. Let me know how you liked it. 
If you like meatloaf in general, let me know how you you know how you dress it. Do you put gravy on there or do you do barbecue sauce or tomato sauce? We had a whole little debate about this, me and my cousins. And my cousin Ebony like gravy and gravy only. Me and Deshaun like ketchup or um, barbecue sauce on ours. Um, what else? Oh, any suggestions or ideas? Um, when it comes to the smile, you know, getting everything together. I've seen a few people tell me put a piece of ice or just... I've been reading so many comments, but I have been trying to take it easy. I ain't been trying to do too much. Just expect a video on my vlog channel tonight. Sometime tonight. It will be out. I love you so much. Please make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Share this video with anyone and everyone. Let me know what we're doing over here. Y'all, when y'all wake up tomorrow, it will be February 1st. A whole new month. So, whatever you didn't get accomplished in the month of January, because it's been a crazy-ass month, we can start over next month and get it together. If you made it this far, please put, um, put a blue heart emoji, a blue heart emoji, and I'll see y'all in the next video. I love you so much. Peace. Love you. Peace.